Sandra has managed to combine a commitment to social justice with all of her efforts in sport, managing to change the status of LGBTQ people within sport, managing to protect children in particular from violence and sexual abuse in sport. All of these issues are connected and they're all about making changes to either practice or policy and advocating for voices typically unheard. I think Sandra has shaped the rowing community in a variety of ways, whether it's in umpiring, whether it's as a board member, she's always making positive change. Her passion for the sport runs deep um, and you can see that, but she just, she always does it quietly in the background. The impact that Sandy's safe sport work has had on world rowing and in the sport of rowing has just been enormous. I really don't think that World Roaring, we wouldn't have achieved half of what we achieved without Sandy's help. She's consistently a high performer and a high contributor. She gets us kind of out of the weeds and into a more strategic level of thinking. Let's not just solve a small problem, let's actually make something bigger and better for the entire community that's going to last long after we're all done and retired. Sandy's very much a, she's a facilitator, She's a connector, she brings people together, she's a doer, I mean, gosh. She is able to assess pretty quickly the skills in a group. Basically, she can adapt and fill whichever skill set is missing in that group in order for the group to deliver on its objectives. Most people rowing today know her as a rowing official, and their creed is safety, fairness, and presentation of the sport which has kind of been her life's work. It's not just what she does in official to make sure that boats are okay on the water. It's the entire culture and community of rowing and of sport that should be safe. And that's what we should be celebrating. Sand is a, she's inspiring. She's a leader, she's an advisor, she's a role model. I'm always inspired by Sandra Kirby, by her accomplishments in the Olympics and uh, by her ongoing accomplishments in sport and in her academic career. I think when you're thinking at her level, it is through the entire continuum. And you can do that by starting small and setting a really good example right where you are. And it's kind of contagious, right? Because the people you influence take it throughout their life and it spreads further and further and further. And that's a better world of sport for all of us. For her to see where it's come from and where we are now is exciting. But to be able to take that even further, I think she'll just keep going for it as long as she can. Huge congratulations for your induction into the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame. Congratulations, Dr. Sandra Kirby, on your induction into the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame. Congratulations on getting into the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame. Thank you for your contribution and congratulations on this high honour.